So if we look back to the belief loan phenomenon, your beliefs influence your behaviors, which influences your success, you know that beliefs play a huge role, right? Spend all morning just working on your beliefs. Because otherwise, it's kind of pointless. You won't take any action. Okay, so there are actually three top beliefs that you need to have when it comes to selling. So even if you do sometimes feel these negative beliefs or these fearful beliefs, I know some of you at home, Barbara and Becky, have been talking about that and being very open and honest about that, which is great. We want to start replacing those beliefs a little bit with these top three beliefs. Okay, so if you open your book, you'll see. So what is the first belief you need to have? You need to believe in the what? You need to believe in the result, okay? So this is really cool because sometimes people don't even think about the result. You think about that thing that you're selling, which I'll talk about in, in a few minutes. But I want you to think about what is the result that you really provide because that's what you're selling. You're selling the result, okay? The second thing you need to believe in is what? What's number two? Offer. All right, so many people don't even know what they're about to offer. They don't even have clarity about their offer. If you don't have clarity about your offer, they're confused. I say this a lot, so you probably know, th know this. A confused mind says and does nothing. We gotta make sure they're very, very clear. And that's why when we go into the stages of the sale and you know every step, the next step, it's so much easier. You know, I know Femmes talk a lot about this, is that it's so awesome that you know what to drive them to and you get paid every step of the way. There's like that one little bar at the bottom where you're actually doing some stuff for free to drive them into your world and give some results in advance, and then you get paid, and then you get paid, and then you get paid, and then you get paid. How many of you like to get paid every step of the way? Big yes. woo. Okay, good. So you have to have clarity about that offer. The last thing you need clarity about and to believe in is the what? It's the system. Great, so you need to have a system. How many of you, before you met me, felt like you had a clear and specific system that you used every time when it came to your sales process. Okay, good, one, two, three, okay, cool. So then my goal, and you use it every time? Oh good, that's very, very good, that was very nice. Okay, cool, how many of you have a system that you use, it's mine now that you use now and it, you just notice it works? Okay, good, a lot of you that are in my mentorship. Okay, so we, we need to just get you to use it, right? Not consistently, and that's cool, I don't either, by the way. So I sometimes, mm, don't follow my system. Like, I know what the system is, I teach the system, but sometimes I get caught up and I go off, you know, off the wagon and I'm not following the system. So if you're following it every time, I'm very impressed. And I'm gonna give you a new system that maybe you can like, I know Mike and I were just talking about how he might be able to take the current system he has and intertwine it with some extra stuff. Look, this is not rocket science. You're gonna see things that you're like, oh, I've seen that before. And, you know, Lisa talked about this before. She's like, oh, well, I want to know more. Sometimes it's not about knowing, okay? You guys know a lot. You're smart people. What I want you to do, I don't even care if everything you learned here was something you've learned in the past. That doesn't matter. I want you to do more. Do more, okay? So you got to believe in the result. You got to believe in the offer, and you got to believe in the system.